Hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to do some of the Royal High quests. Alright, so as we are in the local courtyard, let's see what I have. Now, I've got the texting in class, vending machines, drinks, and the book check. Let's start with the vending machine drinks as we are already in the local courtyard. What you want to do, come over to the vending machines here, and here's the drinks. You can look close if you want, choose a specific drink, but I don't. I really randomly just click it, get whatever. And I'm pretty sure they all cost 25 diamonds, so it does cost money to do this, but it gives you 25 XP. Now we're going to do the texting in class and book check quest, because they are both in here. So once you're in the rainy day classroom, for the book check quest, what you want to do is, all you need to do, as long as you have a notebook, or whatever you call it, textbook, just, when you're in the classroom, take it out once, and your quest is done, and that gives 38 XP. Alright, the next quest I have in here is the texting in class. So to do this one, it's really easy. You go to the phone at the top and choose anyone on your friends list. I'm going to do someone that doesn't play Royal High, so I don't really have to start a conversation with them. So let's go this person, one of my friends, and I just say E usually. I just randomly press it out, and that quest is done. And it gives also 35 XP. Okay, now I'm going to show you guys how to do the homework is due quest, which gives you up to 70 XP, which is amazing. So for this one, you also want to do in the locker courtyard. And you go over to here where one of the doors are, where it has the little do homework UI, and you just click that. And so for this, if you are on computer, you can do the arrows, or you can still choose just to press these, but you have to do these arrows or buttons to make it work. And you just kind of want to complete this, and you can tap these things at the side if you want as well, if you are not on computer. I prefer personally though to go doing it by with my keys. Alright, next I'm going to show you guys how to do the fountain for drinking. So go over to here, there's many places in the Royal High Campus 3 where there are fountains. But because I'm in the locker courtyard already, we'll just do it here. This is a really easy quest as well, you just come over to it and as long as it starts this animation, the drinking from the fountain, you can walk away straight away and it completes which gives 22 XP. Here we are on the main campus. So for this quest, you want to come over to here where the fountain is with the girl on the top, this fountain where you make a wish, you can sit down if you want, personally I like to, and I'm going to choose this emote, and you want, if you have a textbook, you want to grab your textbook out, and open the book, and you just wait until that bar is filled up. Alright, here we are, the quest is finished, and it gives you 66 XP. Alright, next I'm going to show you guys how to do the hair tangles quest. So first thing, if you guys don't have a hairbrush, you want to go to the student dormitories for this. So you can buy a hairbrush, which does cost gems. So if you guys don't have the hairbrush already, I'll show you guys how to get it. So first, make sure you have claimed a door. And then go to the decorate button at the side. Go to furniture, go to shopping and search brush. Now here's the hairbrush, it costs 1750 gems. You can only use the hairbrush, brush short hair, long hair, or ponytail for this quest to actually work. And again, I'm not going to make you guys watch this, so I'm going to speed it up. Alright, we've finished that quest, and it gives you 71 XP. Now I'm going to show you guys how to do the nap time quest. So for this quest, you can use your dorm bed, or someone else's if they let you. But what you have to do is go to dress up, outfits, click sleep, and make sure you have some sleep outfit on, on your avatar. So then I've got my bed over here, and you all want to do sleep. This one doesn't last long, it's a pretty quick one, so yeah. Alright, next I'm going to show you guys how to do the last night's sleepover cleanup quest. This one, you need to have a vacuum, which is always in your inventory, and you go pick it up and you place it down, and you can click it if you want. Or you don't have to have it clicked, which turns on. But either way, it still makes the quest work and make the bar move. Alright, next I'm going to show you guys how to do the dress coded and lost and found quest. For these quests, you need to go to the school office. So let's teleport there now. Alright, here we are in the office again. Now let's show you how to do the lost and found quest first. Over here is a little box with a bunch of like clutter and you want to just take a peek and wait for this bar to fill up. So once you've done this quest, you want to click jump to exit the box and it might glitch you on the floor for a second like it's about to do here. There we go. And that gave me 80 XP. Alright, next I'll show you how to do the dress coded. 
over here is another box with like a pile of smelly clothes and you just want to wear the PE shirt and that's quick so we're just going to stay wearing that while we do this other quest this other quest is the poppy i got her quest which is also in the school office so for this one you want to click talk to poppy and you want to click poppy i got her and you choose any of these just don't choose jk or the quest won't work and then she will give you an ice pack which you have to hold wherever you want make sure you've got it holding on your elbow your knee your head something like that and the quest will go it's a very slow one though so yeah just you got to be patient for some of these quests guys all right guys while this quest is going i just noticed i'm almost level 408 420 i swear just a few hours ago not even a few hours not long about an hour or an hour and a half i got to level 400 and now i'm on 419 these levels go up super quickly the best way to get my levels up are from doing quests and from eating and doing sleeping <coughs> all right we have finished this quest let's see what we've got next now we're in the locker courtyard again let's go over to the powder room so you have to have your toothbrush and you probably saw when i was doing the showing you how to buy the hairbrush you might have seen the toothbrush which you also have to buy so when you've got the toothbrush, you want to click it, make sure it's on, and you want to be near a sink for it to work. Alright, the quest is now done, and this time it gave me 85 XP. While we're in there, oh, I've got the don't be late to class quest. This quest, you want you only have three minutes to do it, so I'll show you guys what it looks like. You only get three minutes to do this one, so you have to go to the classroom doors and go to your musical chess class as quick as you can. This quest, all you need to do is go to the rainy day classroom, enter it and that's the whole quest done but you only have three minutes to do it all right so let's see now i'm going to go back out here to show you guys the vending machine snack time even though i already explained how to do it i'm going to show you just in case you don't know so another quest over here the snack time again like the drinks just choose a random food doesn't really matter to me in my opinion and that's that quest done we're now on a public server and i'm actually spawned in the main campus and there's actually a diamond over here, so perfect coincidence. And that's that quest done. For the class with friends quest, what you want to do, guys, is all you want to do is go to the locker courtyard and have a friend join you inside of the rainy day classroom. And that's that quest done. As long as you're in a rainy day classroom class with a friend that you have on your friends list, that quest will be done. Another royal high quest that you might get is the study sesh. The study sesh quest you can do not by yourself, but at least with one other person or a whole group. What you want to do is you want to have a textbook and make sure the other people have a textbook. Sit down, have your textbooks open until the quest has finished and that's that quest. But it has to be with other people. Alright, we are now in here again in the dorms in a public server though this time. And I'm going to show you how to do the ding dong ditch quest. So you want to go to someone's dorm and it has to be someone that's already claimed. And you just want to click knock and that will be the quest done. Sometimes it's a bit glitchy and it takes a second to pop up. But that is the entire quest. Alright, next I'm going to show you guys how to do the wash your PE clothes. Which is also a, another really simple quest. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open some of these washers. See if there's any clothes. Yep. And then just put them in the dryer. And I'm going to wait for them. So the dry finish and you want to be quick in case someone else takes it and you just take out the clean clothes and that's done <gasps> Oh, we got a new star guys. All right guys I'm gonna end the video here because I think that's all the quests that are currently able to be done If I'm wrong comment down below what quests I didn't do that you have done before uh, And I will see if I can get that in my diary again to try and make a maybe a short on it for you guys uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe, comment down below what videos you want to see next, like the video if you really enjoyed it. Bye guys!